This morning, we're waiting to learn the identity of a man who drowned at a Kansas City apartment complex pool. Happened about 7 o'clock last night at the Shadow Creek Apartments that's at Bannister Road and Drury Avenue. Police tell us the man was in his late 20s to early 30s. Witnesses say they think he may have hit his head in the pool. When paramedics arrived, they found friends of the victim performing CPR, but it was too late. And friends of the victim described the scene as very frantic with a lot of confusion. Jake Peterson joins us live with more on what you should do if you see trouble at the pool this year. Jake. And good morning, Curtis. Friends of this man say that he did not know how to swim. He spent most of his time in the shallow end, but once they saw him underwater in the deep end, they absolutely knew something was wrong. And it seems that the friends here did everything right, according to uh, first responders. They pulled him out of the water, called paramedics, and performed CPR on the man. Friends say it was tough keeping their cool once they realized that this was a life and death situation. Crazy. It was a lot of yelling, screaming. I was, I mean, it was really sad. It was this really sad moment. And it was really hard to try to, you know, concentrate on getting him. And there was a lot of yelling. It's, it's sad and devastating. And I mean, it was, I mean, I feel for his fiance and his family. I just, it's really sad. The University of Washington says the first step in the CPR process is to call 911 to get paramedics on the way. Dispatchers will normally walk you through the process. Next, if the, if the victim is still not breathing normally, then begin chest compressions by pushing down on the center of the chest 30 times. Then pinch the victim's nose and cover their mouth with yours and blow air into their mouth twice. Now, we do know that there are many, uh, we do not know his name yet, but we also have some information that you might want to know about CPR and the process of CPR on our website. That's KSHB.com. We'll have much more on this and the CPR process coming up in about 30 minutes. But for now, we're live in Fairway. Jake Peterson, 41 Action News.